Hello guys, in this video tutorial I will let you know how you can add your Instagram feed into your WordPress website easily. So to do so, you need to access our site's admin or dashboard. Now go over to the plugins option and click on the add new. Now search for the plugin smash balloon. And install this first plugin. And activate it. So after installing and activating the plugin, now we need to go to the Instagram feed. And Click on add new. Now just keep it default and click on next. Add a source. And click on login with the Instagram. Click on the allow So now click on the web Lancers basics and then move over to the next Now we need to customize our Instagram feed. You can click on this to set the layout. You can keep it default Greek. If you have the pro version of the Instagram feed, then you can use the other options like carousel, imaginary, highlight. After that, just go to the color scheme. You can also change the color scheme from the inherit to white, dark or the custom. So you can also move over to the header option and scroll down to see different type of the options and the advanced option as well. Go back and also you can go to the posts and go to images and videos and move over to this. You can select thumbnail, medium or the full size images. You can use the default as auto detect and go to the customize again. You can also set the load mode button, follow up button or you can set your images in the light box. You can also go to the settings to see different type of the sources you have added. You can add this all type of the sources. You can go to the customizer in the feed layout and scroll down to set the number of the posts. I will set 8 on the desktop and 4 on the cell phone. So after doing all this you need to just click on save and now click on the embed. Just copy this short code. Now go to the page where you want to add your Instagram feed. Just click on Enable Visual Builder. Just scroll down. Suppose you want to add your Instagram feed here. Just click on this plus icon. Add a new section. Now search for the Code is your code here and save it. Now you will successfully see that our Instagram feed is present on our website. If you want to use any other builder or the default builder, you can go over to this, go to the pages, click on add new. You can name it feed and click on use default editor. Now just add a blog and you will see Instagram feed is present here. Just click on this. And now you will see that we have successfully added our Instagram feed using the default editor. 
So in this way you can add Instagram feed to your WordPress website using any page builder as the default editor and it's compatible with all type of the themes that are present in the WordPress or the third party themes. So if you found anything good in the video then please make sure to subscribe this channel. Thank you so much.